hello guys welcome back to Vitro tips in this video i'm going to talk about how to fix forza horizon 5 microsoft account login or sign in issue on your pc or laptop and how to fix this app so let's dive into it so the first one as you can see that if you're on the microsoft store and you're having this trouble one of the easiest way to fix the issue is you just have to do sign out from the microsoft then you just have to i mean microsoft store then you just have to sign in back then you have to see and most probably the issue regarding this has to be fixed and in some scenarios this is does not this this only is not working so i'm suggesting some of the parallel solutions which you have to try out so after signing out and signing in back you have to see whether you are done with the solutions and if it's not then you just have to follow these simple instruction so the next one is all about over here you just have to go over here and you have to go for credential manager you have to search for credential manager and open this now from here you just have to go over here windows credential now from here you just have to scroll down and as you can see when you scroll down a little bit over here at the top you'll be getting over here xp device key you'll be getting over here and now you just have to expand this and you just have to remove this right so uh, for me i'm not going to remove this but for you you have to remove this right once you're done with the remove and you have to see whether you are fixed with the issue or this and if it's still persisting then you have one more solution adding up with this what has one by one then you just have to remove these one, uh, one by one and you just have to remove this so this is going to take a little bit time but you just have to uh, go for it you just have to it's going to take a little bit time and you just have to do this and once it is done you just have to close this over here and you just have to follow the next instruction so next instruction you just have to go over here then you just have to go to task manager and from here you just have to go over here on service now from here you just have to go for open service now from here as you can see at the top we have following xbox live networking services xbox live game save and xbox accessory management service and we have following things so you have to make sure all these things should be the startup type should be automatic for all the four and if it's not then you just you can change it between if it's not automatic if it's manual you can change it between you just have to double click and you have to change and if the start highlight is you just have to go for it and go for ok then make sure these are automatic and also apart from this you just have to scroll down and you will be having one options like starting with i over here which is called you have to make sure that also in some cases this is going to help you out also as you can see we have ip helpers you just have to right click and make sure this is also automatic then also these are some of the thing and you just have to go back and at the top you have to make sure and once it is done you just have to close this do a restart and go back to microsoft store and most probably the issue regarding signing will be completely fixed and this is what you have to do and this is how we can fix the issue up and i hope this video is helpful and if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notifications see you soon in the next video peace out